Hey everybody, it's Nikki the Announce Up here, and tonight we are going to announce the winners of the first annual Let's Play Awards. Now, first off, let me just say this was a great year for the Let's Play Awards. Um, there's definitely going to be a second annual Let's Play Awards come this time next year. I made a few friends. I actually subscribed to a few of the um, to a few of the nominees because I like them. I like what they put out, and it was just a lot of fun. And I'm definitely, definitely going to do it again next year. So anyway, uh, just like with the nominees video, um, I'm going to have all the nominees over on this side, and I'll also have uh, their vote percentage and stuff like that, so you'll know what the race was like all the way through. Let's go ahead and get started with our first award, Best Action, excuse me, Best Let's Play of an Action Adventure Game. The nominees were The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker by Masei Anella, Metroid Fusion by Josh Jepsen, Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask by Slim Kirby, Banjo-Tooie by Josh Jepsen, and The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time by Dark Minded Sith. The winner is Banjo-Tooie by Josh Jepsen. It was a close one going with uh, Slim Kirby's Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, but Josh won with the very last vote that was cast. So, congratulations, Josh. Next best let's play of a shooter game. The nominees were... Call of Duty Black Ops by Toby Games, Fallout 3 by Pix Alchemist, Metroid Fusion by Josh Jepsen, and Fallout New Vegas by SSOHPKC. The winner was Metroid Fusion by Josh Jepsen. So Josh has gone two for two in the in the uh, first two awards. Can he sweep? Actually, no, he he doesn't. Spoiler alert, I guess. But yeah, this was a three-man race most of the way through, but. Again, Fusion pulled out with, like, one of the last votes. Alright, best let's play of an RPG. The nominees were Pokemon Crystal by Chuka Conroy, Kingdom Hearts by Robbie Ackenhead, Pokemon Fire Red by SSOHPKC, F Final Fantasy X by Nintendo Capri Sun, and Paper Mario by Icy Dragon 0605. The winner was Pokemon Crystal by Chuka Conroy. This... Like, this one kind of got out of hand quickly. Chugga ended up getting almost half the votes. So, yeah. Uh, NCS was starting to make a comeback towards the end, but it, it didn't work out. Chugga Conroy is the winner. Next up, best let's play of a platformer. The nominees were Super Luigi Galaxy by Chugga Conroy, New Super Mario Bros. Wii by Rerag to Prey, Super Mario Bros. by Mr. Ragetastic96, Mario Search for the Eight Jewels by SSOHPKC, and Sonic the Hedgehog 2006 by Brainscratchcoms. And the winner is Super Luigi Galaxy. This one was as big a runaway as there was in this thing. Almost 75% of the votes just blew them out of the water. Congratulations, Chug. Next best let's play of a horror game. The nominees were Resident Evil 5 by Mage Masher 22 in Tokyo Dome SF4, The Grudge by We Right to Prey, Left 4 Dead 2 by Pix Alchemist, Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines by Obey My Rod, and Amnesia the Dark Descent by Toy Games. And the winner is Resident Evil 5 by Mage Master 22 in Tokyo Dome SF4. This was another one that came right down to the wire, with the last vote deciding it. Next, best let's play of a handheld. The nominees were Pokemon Crystal by Chuka Conroy, Pokemon Emerald by Slowflake, Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep by Wii 187, American Idol by Madame Wario, and Professor Layton and the Unwound Future by Mendez. And the winner is Pokemon Crystal by Chuka Conroy. This was another one that kind of got out of hand. Slowflake was occasionally making up ground on Chugga, but this one was not that close at any point. Chugga won decisively in that one. Next up, best let's play of a non-current generation game. The nominees were Kingdom Hearts by Grand Pyromania. Super Mario 64 by Durden77, Pokemon Emerald by Double Three One, Pokemon Fire Red by SSOHPKC, and The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time by Dark Minded Sith. 
The winner was Pokemon Fire Red by SSOHPKC. Um, this was another three-man race, um, but it, it always looked like um, Pokemon Fire Red would had a slight advantage throughout the whole thing. So, congratulations, SSOH. Now, one of the big ones, Best Let's Play. The nominees were Final Fantasy X by Nintendo Capri Sun. Banjo Tui by Josh Jepson, Pokemon Crystal by Chuga Conroy, Fallout New Vegas by SSOHPKC, and Super Mario 64 by Durden77. And the winner was Pokemon Crystal by Chuga Conroy. I was actually kind of surprised towards the end how um how well Durden77's Super Mario 64 LP was doing, considering that it got more votes for best Let's Play than it got for best non-current generation game. I thought that was a little bit odd. But anyway, congratulations to Chugga again. Next, Best Co-op Let's Play Channel. The nominees were We Are Act to Prey, Brain Scratch Comms, Crystal Star Studio, Ninbuzz, and Hellfire Comms. And the winner, once again, a bit of a blowout by Ninbuzz. Now, I can already hear some of you guys saying that the Ninbuzz one was probably a bit flawed because I got a lot of my votes from the NinBuzz forum and that some of you might be saying that next year I shouldn't uh, use NinBuzz for the Let's Play Awards and to that I say heck no. NinBuzz was where I got like 90% of my votes so I'm, I'm sorry I got a little bit skewed but that's eh, probably because NinBuzz is really really good but and that's that's taken nothing away from the other nominees, but Ninbuzz is pretty good, I must say. Next up, best let's player under 1,000 subscribers. The nominees were Dr. Tran reincarnated, Kevin J 2010, Double Three One, Purple Rodri, and Argon Matrix. The winner was Purple Rodri. Congratulations, Purple. Next, Best Female Let's Player. This one was pretty close most of the way through. The nominees were The Lightning Spirit 78, Donna Bells, Pix Alchemist, Nicola Nintendo, and Splittable Infinitive. The winner was Donna Bells. But this one, like I said, was close all the way through between Donna, Nicola, and Splittable. So congratulations to all the nominees. Best New Let's Player, the nominees were Obey My Rod, Dat Hotness, Koopa Kung Fu, Me You and Me Too, and Purple Rodri. The winner was Koopa Kung Fu. Unfortunately, he's not doing Let's Plays at the moment. He's apparently taking some sort of hiatus, but still, congratulations to Mr. Kung Fu. And finally, the last award of the night and the big one, Best Let's Player. The nominees are Nintendo Capri Sun, Chugga Conroy, Josh Jepson, Dark Minded Sith, and Koopa Kung Fu. And the winner of Best Let's Player is. Okay, these aren't working for drumsticks, so let's just say screw that. The winner is Chugga Conroy. Congratulations. This one, this one was kind of. One-sided, NCS would occasionally make up some ground, but then Chugga would make up twice as much ground. But it was still... Uh, how do I put this? It was still well contested. So congratulations to all the nominees, and thank you to all the people who voted and viewed. This was, like I said, this was a great success, and there will be one of these next year. So this has been Nikki V 917 saying thanks for watching, and I'll see you right back here next year for the second annual Let's Play Awards, or if you actually watch the rest of my videos, uh, I'll have an episode of Pokemon Coliseum up probably on the first or so. See you later.